Hey y'all and welcome to the Max Life. So in today's video, I really want to explain to you guys a couple of things that I have uncovered over the past couple of days. I want to let y'all know what I have been doing, what I have discovered, and where we have to go from here. So let's jump into that right now. Okay, y'all, so a lot of you guys, and I'm so thankful for this, have really reached out. Emails, guys, I have gotten so many emails, and I'm so thankful. A lot of y'all have told me things to do, people to call, and you know what? I have done a lot of those. I have started a checklist. I have been on the phone for several days. I have contacted our Attorney General's office to make them aware of the situation and the really crisis we have going on here in the US with these gift cards. I have also been on the phone with one of my senator's offices. Of course, I was not able to get on the phone with her, but to fully explain the concerns that we as American citizens have with this gift card scamming. I have also, and y'all, this is where I really feel like I was heard the most, got on the phone with my local representative, and y'all, she was ready to, out of all the people that I have talked to, guys, she was ready to roll up her sleeves, she was ready to get on the phone, she was ready to make this known, and aware that a lot of these cards are being jeopardized, and we, the consumers, are going into the store, um, taking a risk on buying these products and although the private companies have the right to sell items that are risky like cigarettes for example there are lots of different risky items i think about the junk food that could cause cancer as well they have the right to sell these risky items right However, at least as a consumer going into the store, you're going in, you're not knowing that you're taking this risk by buying this gift card that could very well be scammed. Also, we are, most of us, I was completely unaware that this was a problem in our nation. So a couple of issues I really feel like need to be addressed, but my local representative was really the only person that was ready to roll up her sleeves, make this known, and speak out about these jeopardized cards that Walmart continues to sell to American consumers, many of which did not even know this was a thing, me being one of those. So let's get busy doing some work and not only making people aware of what's going on but letting walmart know that we do not want to buy their gift cards because we are the ones suffering the consequences of buying their product so let's let them know now i have done a lot of digging over the past couple of days guys i cannot find a mailing address I cannot find an email address. There are a lot of big wigs, CEOs, executives, all of this fancy terminology for the higher ups. And you know, sadly, there's not really a way to get in contact with these people. They have really put all of their information in the closet. So to be able to get in touch with them has really been a challenge. But I'm gonna tell y'all what I did. I was able to find some links to their social medias, to some of their social medias. Let's get on their social medias and tell them to stop selling the cards. And let's tell them that we don't wanna be victims of scammers. And the only way for that to take place is for them to stop selling the cards. The other thing that we can do, guys, I have, I have a couple of numbers to Walmart to call. I also have an email, a couple of emails that I'm gonna stick in my description as well. So this is, I've been doing all of that digging. I've been doing all that digging. I've been spending time on the phone, gathering information, because I'll tell you one thing that I have found out is I am one person, I have one voice, and they are not listening to me. So I need your help. 
Guys, you have to let them know that as an American consumer, you are just as concerned as I am because guys, I have started doing all the things, making all the calls. I have already done all of that and they're not listening to me. So I'm gonna have to have your help. It won't take just a couple of minutes to pick up the phone and say, stop selling your gift cards. We don't wanna be victims of scammers express your concern and if you have been a victim of walmart's scammed cards tell your story guys you have to call them you have to speak out y'all get on their social media pages and let them know i cannot do this on my own and that's one thing that i have discovered in all of this i have tried i've done all of the things I cannot do it on my own. I'm one voice and they will not listen to me. So we are gonna have to speak up together and speak loud enough to let them know we don't want their cards to take them off the racks. We don't want to fall victims of this scamming ring that's happening. And obviously, from my experience, they're not standing behind that product. And many of you guys, vast majority of you guys have also told me the same thing that you have experienced, but y'all, they're not gonna listen to one person. It's gonna take all of us calling, sending emails and voicing our concerns to Walmart and telling them to get the cards off. That is everything that has happened. What I have really uncovered in these past couple of days that I'm not gonna be heard without your help. So I need you guys to get on the phones, send emails, make calls. I've really tried to make it easy for y'all gathering up all of these links, all of the information. Guys, if you click in my description, at the very top, front and foremost, I'm gonna have all of the information, all of the numbers, all of the links to the social media. So all you have to do is click. I really tried to make this easy for you guys because I know that we're all busy and we all have our own normal lives. So I really tried to make that easy for you guys to just click that and you guys will see all of the information that I have gathered. Also, I will have pinned in the comments if you have a hard time finding the description part of my channel, just go into the comments and you'll see the pinned comment. I'll also have all of the the information there as well because I want to make this easy for you guys as well. Let them know your stories and let them know that you're concerned con citizens about the products that they're selling and we have to do this together. That is the only way we're going to make a difference. Guys, you have to join in and you it won't take long. You just have to pick up the phone and do it. So I'm asking you guys to take that step forward. You've heard my story go back a couple of YouTube videos and look in the comments. I'm not the only one, guys. I'm not the only one. There have been so many people that this has happened to. And in order to make this stop, it's going to take us all coming together as concerned citizens and voicing our opinions. So guys, that's where I'm at right now. My work is not done. I am still working on this, this awareness. So share this video you do your job you ask your family and friends to do their job as well so that we can make this known and we can take one step forward to also um hope that walmart will hear us all together and realize that we are concerned citizens and that something needs to be done so thank you guys for joining us Thank you for listening to my heart and my concerns. Now, I'm just one of many, like I told you guys. I know that's happened to a lot of people, but we have to join forces together. So thank you for listening. Thank you for joining in. I appreciate all of y'all that have commented and told me what's happened to you. You guys have sent me email. I thank you from the bottom of my heart for that and helping this and really helping this to move forward because I can't do this without you guys. So thank you again. God bless and happy homesteading, y'all. With the words of a lullaby.